At the end of this video, you will know how to create a night to day transition in Femoir 11. Keep watching! Hi everyone, this is Chloe from Wanashare Femoir here to empower your inner video creator. Do you ever wish you could turn nighttime into daytime? It would make getting ready in the morning so much faster. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use keyframe and mask features in Formar 11 to create this cool night-to-day transition. First, let's get the footage ready for editing. We will need two shots for this effect with the same frame. One is for daytime and the other one is for nighttime. While filming, make sure the camera is on a tripod and stay at the same point, so the frame doesn't change. After figuring out the frame, Put a marker on the floor to ensure the action is consistent in the two shots. I'm going to film the daytime clip first. I will walk and pretend I'm transitioning into nighttime at the mark. Next, I will change the scene. I'm changing some set decoration and placing a few practical lights. I'm also dimming the light down a bit and changing the camera white balance to a more blue settings to create a nighttime feeling. Then, I'm switching costumes to make the effect more convincing. Now, let's film the nighttime clip. I will walk through the living room and do the exact same movement again at the same spot. Now that we have the footage, let's go into Femoir 11 and start editing. If you haven't downloaded Femoir 11 already, get started by going to femoiradawanashare.com or click the link in the description. I'm going to place the nighttime video clip on the first video track of the timeline and place the daytime clip on the top. Let's find the spot where I start to wave in the daytime clip. Make a cut and delete the previous part. Make sure the timing of the waving action in both clips syncs. Then I'm going to make a masking transition with the Femora mask feature. Double click the daytime clip on the timeline. Go to the Femora setting window on the top left. Find the mask section and select the circle shape. Now we can see the mask is applied. Add the first keyframe at the beginning of this clip. Change the scale of the mask to the smallest number and adjust the numbers of width and height down to zero. Although I can't see the mask now, I'm going to set the blood strength number to 15%. So I can keep the setting for the keyframes that I'm going to add later. Then, move the playhead to find the spot where I want the mask to fully open up and add another keyframe. Change the scale of the mask to 200% and the number of width and height to 50%. Make sure the mask covers the whole frame here. Now, if I play back, I can see the nighttime becomes daytime through the mask, but my movement in the two clip is a bit off. I can fix it by adding more keyframes on the mask. Click on the Add button to add a new keyframe here. Change the position, scale, and the shape of the mask to show only a small part of my body in the daytime clip. Move the playhead one frame to the right and click on the Add button again. Change the position, scale, and the shape of the mask to show my full body. Now the mask transition looks much smoother. Finally, let's add one more effect in Femoir to make it more magical. Open the effect window on the top left and find Heartbeat under Basic section. Drag and drop it onto the third video track. Then trim the lens of the effect to match my movement. Okay, let's play back and see how it looks. And that's how to create a night to day effect using masking transitions in Femora 11. Masking transition is a cool tool that can be used in a variety of ways. How will you use the masking transitions in your next video? Let us know in the comments. Or even better, link us to the videos. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe for the new videos on the channel. Keep creating and see you next time.